Well, the freeway divided a neighborhood. So the freeway was put in in the late 50s, and fortunately it got stopped at Fell and Oak Street. A woman named Sue Bierman at the time with some other activists in the late 50s said, stop, what are you doing? They were gonna put the freeway through Golden Gate Park. So they stopped it at Laguna at uh, Fell and Oak there. But then a spur of it went over across in front of City Hall and dropped down and around Eddy. So the freeway divided our neighborhood between the other side and this side. And so having it down was gonna reunite our neighborhood because in the 300 block, the Hay Street Grill came in about 1980 when Davies Symphony Hall came. That was also a pretty derelict block. But in 1980, Patricia Unterman, a different Patricia, uh, started the Hay Street Grill. She took a risk um, opening in no man's land basically and her restaurant is still there and she's very successful and then now absinthe is there so that block developed from 1980 on our block started my block i call it um, started in 1990 and so it was you know a lag time but totally divided by the freeway so having the freeway down meant we could have our block parties extend to all three blocks and we just had a a larger presence it made more sense than we were prepared we didn't know if we were going to get it to happen or not so we were prepared to stay as the bad block because we were all a little bit rebellious and had uh, parties um, the 300 block was a little more conservative their customers were the symphony and opera crowd we liked mixing mixing it up and they liked it too because we were getting a lot of attention we were being written about a lot in the papers um, so having it down was important. Now we had to talk about, we worked with the planning department, probably seven or eight of us would go, they called them design charrettes, these planning uh, meetings, where we talked about how high the building should be, uh, green rooftops, we wanted an open space, and that's how Patricia's Green was. Um, we actually wanted originally to have the green, the center place, and then we wanted a walkway that went from there that meandered where the freeway had been in front of City Hall. So people could see how, what a wide swath it had taken. We didn't get that. The developers you know, said, oh no, we need all that. 